keep in mind that the studies showing extension of life in different species, including mice, um, show that being fairly dramatically sub-maintenance caloric extends lifespan, but you're also potentially um, sub-happiness when you're that sub-caloric, um, potentially pretty weak Im Im immunologically too, potentially, potentially physically weak. Okay. So yes, starving yourself within reason can extend your lifespan, but you also starve yourself of joy and vigor, right? I mean, at some point you are sub-caloric enough that testosterone levels plummet in men and women, libido plummets, fertility plummets in men and women. So, you know, it's a trade-off. Um, I don't take rapamycin. I don't take metformin. I don't even take berberine, which is poor man's metformin. It um, makes me very hypoglycemic for reasons that make total sense based on the mechanisms of metformin and berberine. Um, I do take sublingual NMN, but this is very important but I don't take it to extend my lifespan. I take sublingual NMN. And by the way, I have no affiliation to any supplement company that sells NMN. Um, 